Sam. So today I'm going to be doing the holiday tag for 2015, or maybe it's a Christmas tag. I can't remember what it's called. But it's like a Christmas tag or a holiday tag. And it's 10 questions, and I just saw it floating around on YouTube and thought it would be super fun to do. If you guys want to do it, then I tag you all. Um, and I'll leave the questions in the description box below. But I'm going to be doing this with my friend Julie, Julie G713. I absolutely love her. If you guys don't know who she is, she is another beauty guru. She's been doing it for... I think even longer than I have and she's awesome I watched her years and years and years ago and she has her own nail polish line and eyelashes and her nail polishes are bomb like it's amazing so if you haven't checked them out they are at Rite Aid they are called Julie G and they're literally such good nail polishes but she is a sweetheart she stayed with us um, for I think like I don't know four or five days um, in Tahoe over the summer and we had so much fun with her she's so genuinely sweet like she honestly is such a nice person like she's got such a kind heart and she's real and she's genuine and she like truly cares about people and I really really love her she's just so kind she's one of the best people I've ever met so be sure to go and check her out she also has a vlog channel she has a cute little puppy dog he's adorable and I have a, sc I have a sparkle in my eye right now please hold Anyway, so go and check her out. I'll leave her link down below to her video as well as her channel so you guys can go and subscribe if you don't already know who she is, but you guys probably should because she's fabulous um, and she's absolutely gorgeous. Her skin is like flawless. She doesn't even need to wear makeup. Her skin is so perfect. It's beautiful. I was so jealous when she was here. I was like, she could just wake up and look fabulous and not have to spend forever. Anyway, so the question number one. What is your favorite holiday movie? So for me, I love Love Actually because I really, really, really like Hugh Grant. I kind of think he's like dishy, as my grandma would say. Um, there's something about Hugh Grant that like he's not necessarily attractive, but he has like a really good like something to him. Um, and I really love that movie. It's just one of my absolute favorites. So that's definitely got to be my favorite holiday or Christmas movie. Uh, number two, favorite Christmas color. Now, I think a lot of people are going to be like, well, red or green, but I'm just going to say gold. That's my favorite Christmas color. Or white. Actually, white and gold. Surprise. Number three, PJs or dress up for Christmas Day. So, I feel like every single morning or every single Christmas morning, you're always usually in your PJs. Um, and then if you're going to go somewhere, then obviously you would dress up. But I'm not a super duper dressy uppy person, so I would never like wear a Christmas dress or anything. I would just put like a cute shirt on or something and do my hair. Number four, if you could only buy one person a present, who would it be? Obviously it would be my kids and I wouldn't be able to choose. So I'd pick a present that they could both play with. Number five, do you open your presents Christmas Eve or Christmas morning? So we never... I don't think we were ever able to open Christmas presents on Christmas Eve. Pretty sure we weren't. So we always did a Christmas morning, but with the kids, I have started a tradition where on Christmas Eve, they get to open a present on the morning of Christmas Eve from their elf, and then in the evening as well. So usually the morning, um, their elf will bring them Christmas PJs so that they can wear that that evening for Christmas Eve and Christmas morning. And then Christmas Eve, we let them open a present under the tree, and it's always a Christmas book so that we can read it before bedtime. But number six, have you ever built a gingerbread house? Yes, we never built a gingerbread house before we had kids, but ever since we've had kids, we always get one every single year. Actually, I need to get one this year. Um, and they're really fun, although every time we buy the box ones, they are always broken. Like, ours, ours always are mangled. Number seven, what do you like to do on your Christmas break? So I am not in school, so I don't get a Christmas break. I'm a mom. <laughs> what do people do on Christmas break? I don't even remember. It's been so long since I've been out of school that I don't really remember. I guess you would just hang out with your friends and stuff. But yeah, I don't have a Christmas break. Number eight, any Christmas wishes? So my Christmas wish actually just came true last night while I was on You Now. Um, all I wanted for this year was for my channel this channel it, to reach 200,000 subscribers because I've been doing it for six years I have been really 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 like hoping that I could reach 200,000 before the end of 2015 and I I made my goal last night so that was my Christmas wish that is all I wanted to happen um, as like a goal for myself and so that has happened the other Christmas wish is that my sister will move to Tahoe 
nothing big, not a big wish at all. Number eight, uh, oh sorry, number nine, favorite Christmas smell. Um, I'm gonna have to say those like cinnamon pine cones. I really like the smell of those cinnamon pine cones and it always reminds me of Christmas. Number 10, favorite food or favorite treat? So my favorite food for Christmas would probably be cauliflower cheese. That is like my favorite thing ever and my, whenever we had like Christmas uh, in England, there would always be cauliflower cheese and it was so good. And then my favorite treat is apple crumble. I'm quite simple really, just give me some cheese and some, you know, crumbles and I'm good. So that was my tag, my Christmas tag. I hope you guys all found this fun. I, it gets you in the spirit. I'm wearing my Christmas sweater that I got from It's Judy time and I love it. I felt so special. If you guys haven't seen that vlog, I will link the vlog down below, but she sent me a sweater and it made me feel really, really special. So thank you, Judy. And, um, yeah, give me a thumbs up if you had fun watching this. Don't forget to check out Julie's. I will leave the link down below. Be sure to subscribe to her and tell her that I sent you. And if you're coming over from Julie's channel, welcome. I hope you guys enjoy my video. I'm kind of sick right now, so I sound kind of cruddy. But thank you guys. Happy holidays. I hope you guys all have an amazing Christmas because I believe I'm going to be putting this up on Christmas. Yeah, so I guess I should say Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, whatever you guys celebrate. I hope you guys are all having a great day with your family or friends, and I hope it's very, very merry this year. Thank you guys all so very much for this year. I had an awesome year. It was probably one of my favorites so far, and I want to say thank you guys because without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do a job that I love so very, very much, and I wouldn't be able to have the life that I have. So thank you guys. You guys are the best. I love you so much. And I will see you in my next video, which will be my top 15 or best 15 of 2015. Um, so I think that'll be the next video that you'll see. Thank you guys. I love you. Mwah. Bye. Merry Christmas. Ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas. Did I sound like Santa? Ha, <laughs> ha. Okay, bye. <laughs> phone. Oh, it's right there. Watch more on. I was watching videos on it.